state police make a huge dent in Connecticut's missing person cases, all thanks to a new investigative unit. State police say two cold cases have now been cracked. One of those cases dates back to the 80s. News 8's Aaron Logan found out more. This is the scene of a fatal hit and run on I-91 in Meriden in 2008. Now, after four years of mystery, the victim is identified as 50-year-old Fat Hugh Mai from Massachusetts. It's a real good example of how advocacy, investigation, and science can get together to solve all cases. Connecticut State Police announced not one, but two breakthroughs in missing persons cold cases. Since their missing persons unit started in March, they've cleared 10 percent of their caseload. Mai's family went on the missing persons website, NamUs, and communicated with state police. That was in April. Ultimately, I obtained DNA from the family in Massachusetts, and the samples were submitted to our lab here in Connecticut. Within weeks, the lab was able to make a positive um, match. The second breakthrough, a case from 31 years ago, a missing skull in Waterbury. It turns out that victim was 62-year-old Kenneth Lamana. Waterbury police asked for assistance from state police. They found similarities in dental work and compared them on NamUs. Waterbury traveled out to um, the state of Pennsylvania to obtain a DNA sample uh, from Kenny Lamana's mother. And shortly after, answers. Mrs. Lamana, who is in Pennsylvania, is uh, certainly not uh, a young woman now, has closure that Kenny has been identified. Aaron Logan, News 8.